you rise before the sun and get ready for a long day of hard work. But it's not a burden. As you look out over the land, you breathe in the richness of the earth. Listen to the animals awaken with the sun. It's in your blood. The connection to the earth, the animals, the cycle of life. You are a farmer. The days are long but rewarding. The work is hard. And the equipment works even harder. But what happens when your equipment stops working? The bolt is seized. There's a rusted bearing that won't allow the sprayer to work. Every second is precious in getting the work done. The longer it takes, the less time you have for family and community. So, how do you fix it? Quickly. Induction Innovations has harnessed the power of invisible heat to make repairing faster, easier, and safer. By using induction heating, our tools offer a combination of speed, consistency, and control. All by using invisible, flameless heat generated by electromagnetic waves. Here's an example of how induction innovations can work for you. For this demonstration, we have selected the Miniductor Venom. We have frozen or corroded and rusted fasteners and bolts. First, you'll need to prepare the Mini Ductor Venom by selecting the correct coil and securing it with the twist lock. Place the coil around the fastener or bolt and heat. Be cautious not to overheat or turn red hot. Heat for 3 to 5 seconds. Back it away. And try to release it with a wrench or socket. If it's still frozen, apply the coil for another 2 seconds and try the wrench again. There is usually no reason to heat a nut to red hot condition to free it from the corrosion holding it to the bolt. Our flameless heating tools are designed to solve problems. Induction heat is localized on the specific part rather than the surrounding area, allowing our induction heaters to be used near flammable or combustible material without the risk of equipment or barns setting on fire. Harness the power of invisible heat. Visit your local tool professional or theinductor.com to order your induction heater today.